I'm not going to be able to see you, but you can see me. All right, so we've all learned to do the 180 toe stop by stepping through it. One foot in front of the other, you turn your back foot and you turn into it. You step through it. The 180 toe stop can be made a lot easier though. It's scary at first, don't get me wrong. But if while your momentum is going forward, you leave the ground to hair and snap your hips the opposite direction, you can actually stop a lot quicker. Now the key with this is not only the snap of the hips, but to have a wide base. You do not want your feet to stop in your 180 toe stop together. If they stop together, well, someone else on the other team is gonna notice that and knock you right off of your skates. The other thing to keep in mind is to keep your head up. The floor will still be there at the end of your 180. All right, snap your hips, don't hop into it. Wide base, some examples. To help with the strength in that back foot push, this drill. Kind of like your eggshells, only the right foot does nothing. It'll move every now and again, that's okay. The point is, your left foot is moving back and forth and propelling you forward. Do a few laps of these. Do these every open skate. The more you do it, I promise you, the stronger that back foot will be the more confident you'll be, the better balance you'll, you'll have. All right, now with your crossovers, one thing that's really important to remember, more than pushing with your back foot, is stepping over with your front. You only have so much leg. The lower you get, the more leg you can use. I have short legs. I have to get really low in my squat in order to be able to push with that back leg. Now there are some equipment things that come into this. If your trucks aren't loose or your bushings are too hard or the wrong shape, you might not get the right movement on your wheels. You might have to work a little harder or you'll feel like your skates are coming out from underneath you. You can't turn as, as easily. Go to your local skate shop, call up as the bearing turns, call up Fantastic. They'll help you out. After your gear is ready, you can get low, push with the back, step with the front. It's amazing how many seconds will come off of your uh, 25 and 5 if you're just doing that little thing. <laughs> 